crazy. You guys like? He stepped out there earlier and he's like, eh, nope, not happening. <laughs> Where are you going? I'm gonna shovel. Stop. <laughs> As you guys can see, we had like a huge snowstorm. Um, I do believe the news channel said that we got up to 15 inches and that it was at like four o'clock this morning and it was still snowing. So we probably got more than that, honestly. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna do some dishes since we can't go anywhere. But uh, yeah, my husband's out there Snow or plowing the snow. Cruzy is out there playing in it. He would not go outside this morning. I think I recorded that and uh, put it in. I'll put it in. But uh, yeah, he would not go outside for nothing. I kept like, I'd walk and be like, come on, Cruzy, come on, come on, come on. And he would take a step out. And as soon as he stepped out there, he's like, no, not happening, mom. Not today. But, um, yeah. Oh, and we also got a better light in Lincoln's room. So you guys can, like, actually see. Sorry, his room is a mess because of us remodeling. But, um, like I told you guys before, I did that when I was pregnant. I painted the, um, these letters. I got all these letters from Walmart for, like, a dollar something a piece. And when I went to Joanne Fabrics... They wanted like $5 a piece for each one of these letters. And then I went and got uh, these like 3D stickers from the Dollar Tree and put those on. And this here was the footprints in the sand was my um, mom's, well, my grandma, my mamma Nikki got this for me at my mom's funeral. So I hung that up in Lincoln's room. And then these are just random mirrors that are sitting there. That's my little pile of stuff because I did get rid of my vanity. And then there's Lincoln's little changing table. So I changed his diapers. But uh, yeah, I'll, we'll do a room tour. Um, Not like It'll probably be in like a week or so. I'll do like a room tour for you guys. Like a more in-depth room tour. And uh, yeah. But I'm going to do the dishes. And we're going to try to be able to get out of the house to get some of this bathroom done. The guys, I guess, forgot some plum uh, a drain for the shower. They forgot that. And then they got the wrong size piping for the um, sewage pipe, I guess, for the toilet. So they have to go back to Lowe's and get that, so, yeah. Oh my gosh. Here, you want your coffee? Yeah, thank you. Oh my gosh. Peed all Be over. Careful, babe. Huh? So much snow. Me and Lincoln are doing housework. He's sleeping. And he is in his tot wrap. Here's a little tag for it. Jim in my tot wrap, huh, baby? And the guys just got done, um, did a little more work on the bathroom. And 
grandpa wants to go eat because I live right next door and um, then they're going to continue. And then we're going to try to go to Mansfield because we have a little bit of grocery shopping that we need to do. And um, it went from a level 3 to a level 2 snow emergency. Level 3, in case you guys are not from around here and I don't know if it's the same there. But a level 3 is where you are not allowed to on the road unless it is necessary unless you are a emergency vehicle and um now it's a level two which you can be on the road when it's level two so that is what we're going to do um i gotta do something with this hair today it's been up in a um a claw for days now well, since I washed it yesterday, but I've been wearing it up in a claw for a long time now. And, um, yeah. But, uh, that is what we're doing. Um, a lot of people ask me if my eyebrows are, um, either like drawn on or anything like that. Um, my eyebrows are actually natural. Um, sometimes I will, like usually I'll color in just a little bit, but sometimes I can just get away with combing through them and it'll be okay, but I naturally have thick eyebrows. Like I already need to do all that's grown in, so I need to get those done now. See right there? Yeah, I need to get all that done. And then that right there needs done as well. But, um, yeah, we're going, we're putting these clothes away. And then, um, we're going to clean up a little bit in his room. Me and my husband are going to have to share a closet now since, um, we tore out his, the closet in the bedroom to add on to the bathroom. So me and him are going to have to share a closet. So we're going to take all the clothes that I had um, put up for Lincoln's, like his three to six, six to nine and up. Um, I had it like hanging up. Some of the stuff that I had already bought on hangers was hanging up. But I think what I'm going to do is take that stuff down and put it in the baskets that I have already separated. Like 3 to 6, um, 6 to 9, 9 to 12, things like that. I'm just going to go ahead and put it in those um, bins. And that way my husband can have one side and I can have the other side because they're connected. But what I'll do is, is I'll switch him. That way he doesn't have to come into Lincoln's room. I'll just come into Lincoln's room. I'm kind of weird like that, and it's weird because that's his dad, but I don't know. I just, like, this is, like, you know, our, like, little safety zone. I don't know. I'm weird. Anyways. But, um, I want to do a get ready with me, and I keep talking to you guys about it. And I think maybe, um, maybe tomorrow I'll do a get ready with me. I don't like doing them and not really having to go anywhere because I feel like it's a waste of makeup and I don't like wasting makeup because I love makeup. But, um, yeah, I'm going to start doing my makeup every day just because it makes me feel better, you know, because I have a little bit of extra, like, belly fat on me and I don't like it like that. Is, I don't know, and it makes me feel like I'm so big, and I don't like it. I feel like I'm real ashamed of my body still yet from having him. Um, I didn't get really, like, stretch marks or anything. Um, my boobs have been about the same size after, like, I stopped completely breastfeeding. Um, and I want to do a complete video on that. Um... 
And I also want to do our birth story. And now, since I have my camera, I can do all that. Um, but yeah, this is just like another day of being at home, not doing anything. Snowed in. We got a total of 17 inches of snow. And it was quite a bit. Like, we, I almost couldn't even open the door. That's how much snow we got. It was crazy. But, uh, yeah. It's completely, completely, completely insane. Um, we started a change jar thing for Lincoln. So, in every one of his, uh, in every one of his formulas, formula cans I keep every other one I keep and um, we started this on January 2nd of 2019 and it's about halfway full now every bit of change that we get loose change goes into his jars um, and sometimes we'll throw like dollar bills in there and stuff but, um, for the most part, it's loose change, but every bit of it we throw into these jars, and when he turns 18, then he can have them, and he can do what he wishes with them. My wish for him would be to help him pay for college or a car to get him back and forth to work or anything like that, but that is actually 17 almost 18 years away from now so a lot can change like in technology wise with cars just in life in general so it's whatever he feels that he needs at that time but he gets it when he turns 18 and I just thought that was like a good idea good way to help save money and then you know as he gets older we'll put even more money in there plus our change and stuff but for now we're just doing like our loose change um, his little, I'm trying to find a place because I didn't bring my tripod on here. For his, um, socks and stuff. For his socks and stuff, we put in this bag right here. That is just laying in his crib because I was in a hurry. That's that mom life. But, um, I got this bag right here that is a, it was a bag for curtains. But, I will stick his little socks, and he's got socks and hats and mittens in here. And that is where we keep all of that. For right now. And then, like, his little, his pants. Oh, well, hi, Cruzy. What do Cruzy do? Cruzy. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. That's Cruzy do. Um, his pants and stuff go in here. And then this is stuff right here that needs to be put in his closet, some more wipes. Because every time I go to the store, I pick up um, at least one or two packs of wipes. That way I never run out. And right now we are down to two boxes. Well, two and a half because I have one in here. I went and got these little things from the dollar store like before I had him. And if you buy diapers by the box, one of the packs fit completely really, really nice and neatly in here. So it's just a, just a little storage thing. They come in two in a bundle. And I just put that down there. I always keep one for the changing station that I have in the living room and then I keep one in here along with all of his creams, 
this powder if I ever need to use it. Better so you guys can see that a little bit better. The powder if I ever need to use it. And then each one of his like diaper creams I have in here. We're almost out of this desitin. But I still have it because it's not completely gone. And then usually a pack of wipes, like once I use a couple of the diapers, a pack of the wipes will fit right back in there. But right now it's brand new, so I have to leave it on top. But um his onesies and stuff I put down in here. Onesies go here. This right here is all onesies. And then these right here are sleepers. Another sleep sleeper sleepers and then gowns. These are all his gowns. And that's like real quick access. Like when I'm changing him, that way I can just do it, grab it real quick out of the drawer, put it right on there. I don't have to walk away from him, away from the changing table just to get to it. So he's got his little dresser thing over there and then that's like real quick so I don't have to walk away from him on the t uh, changing table. So I thought that was a good idea when I was putting his room together. But let's go into here and put away towels. And then I washed our blankets. So I can get that stuff out too. It takes a lot to carry around a two month old and it's hot wrap. I am so sorry that the windows right here and it's hard for you guys to see me. But um it is pretty hard to carry around a two month old and it's hot wrap and a basket of clothes. Crap, I forgot that burp cloth to put it away. I gotta put this burp cloth away and we'll get his blankets out of the we'll get his blankets out of the dryer. And then put those away. Let me put these socks up too. These here are our washer. That's the washer, and here's our dryer. But I washed his blankets today. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, I washed the blankets today. And I wash his blankets once a week because, you know, a lot, some of those we use, like, take outside because I don't want to bring in, like, outside germs or anything. I don't know if that's, like, really that possible, but. I know I don't want to do it because I don't want to make my baby sick. So I make sure that I wash them. But, um, there's really not much left but um I'm not gonna completely end the vlog here because you know I always like end it right in the middle of the day and then it's like crap I could have put this in the vlog but sometimes like I'll be like okay well I could just put it in tomorrow's vlog and then I end up deleting it and I don't know I need to get this down I need to get myself a schedule down like record this day edit that night have it up the next day type thing but I like to record all the time though. So I might just start like recording and uploading about every day. I don't know. 
what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below and um, if you like this video please give it a thumbs up hit that uh, subscribe button if you have not already and make sure you have your post notifications on that way you get all of my videos and um, have a wonderful day love you bye after I said I wasn't gonna end the vlog that wasn't an end to the vlog I promise We just got back from Grandma's. We had to go over there to take a shower because we do not have a shower here at the house. Oh, my face looks so red. But, um, take my coat off here and hold the camera at the same time. I used my Dove body wash. Ooh. I use my Dove body wash, the cucumber and green tea scent body wash, and I used my Matrix Oil Wonders Volume Rose Shampoo, and my Matrix Oil Wonders volume rose conditioner and I exfoliated with the charcoal and black sugar mask by Freeman and I carried everything over there with this bag and I'm not exactly sure who it's by because it doesn't say. But yeah, that's what I did. And I'm getting ready to feed Lincoln with his Dr. Brown's bottle. And then we are going to bed right afterwards. So we have to take my husband to work in the morning and yeah I'm gonna have me a little snack and so I'm gonna feed Lincoln and eat myself and then I am going to lay down and go to sleep and uh, I will see you guys in my next video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already and make sure your post notifications is on. That way you get my next video. Bye.